Hey everyone, it's Chris at saltwaterwitch.com. Check out my astral blog and a bunch of everything else over there. A couple months ago, I bought a ZWO ASI 2600mm Pro monochrome camera. June and July consistently delivered terrible weather for anything astronomical, here in the, here in the Northeast US anyway. There was one clear-ish night somewhere in the middle of the waves of thunderstorms, torrential rain, and general cloudiness but on that one night, we were close to a full moon, and you know, and a few hours of clear skies amid weeks of cloud that followed that night just wasn't worth the effort to set up. So I waited uh, for the next opportunity, and that was uh, the other night, August 11th. Uh, I set up the Skywatcher mount, that's the EQ6R Pro, with the William Optic Space Cat and my new camera, which, as I said, I bought a couple months ago. So here's the result of my first imaging run with the ASI 2600mm Pro mono camera cooled to negative 10 Celsius. Uh, this is with the uh, Antlia 3 nanometer Hydrogen Alpha Pro imaging filters, a uh, filter. This is the two inch mounted version of that. And uh, I, I shot 52 300 second subs, but I think I ended up only stacking maybe 46 or 47. Very minimal calibration. I did bias in dark frames and only only like 12 or 13 dark frames, no flat frames. So the ASI 2600 is built around the monochrome version of the Sony IMX571 APS-C sized sensor. And although you can get away with 36 millimeter unmounted filters, I went all the way to two inch mounted uh, filters and you know, not even a hint of vignetting, which partly wh why I did that. The other is, you know, looking ahead to the future when I'll go full frame. So I didn't use flat frames with when stacking. I didn't even shoot flat frames. And uh, so am I impressed with the ZWO ASI 2600 MM Pro? Yeah, yeah. Clear skies.